The Rand Corporation, a think tank tasked with developing strategies for the Pentagon, claimed that none of the U.S. allies in the Pacific are currently willing to host intermediate range missiles. Instead, the report's author advised that Washington should encourage Japan to develop a missile arsenal of its own in order to threaten Chinese ships. In the report, which Rand publicized, analyst Jeffrey Horning argued that the likely receptivity to hosting such systems is very low as long as current domestic political conditions and regional security trends hold, pointing specifically to Thailand, Australia, South Korea, the Philippines and Japan. Horning said, so long as Thailand has a military-backed government that shows a propensity to pursue closer ties with China, the U.S. wouldn't want to base missiles there, and the Thai would be unlikely to accept if asked. Horning also wrote, the Philippines is also extremely unlikely to accept U.S. missiles. Even though the Philippine public and elite generally support the U.S. and the alliance, President Rodrigo Duterte has pursued policies that negatively affect ties. The report also mentioned that South Korea, which has ties to China, is highly unlikely to consent to host U.S. missiles. The report concluded that although the missiles would not be capable of deep strikes into China, if they were deployed on Japan, they would be able to cover strategic ship movements, thereby extending the range at which Chinese assets could be held at war planning risk.